China's Insane Fish Farm Mega Project in the Desert. China's Fish Farm Mega Project, located in the vast Gobi Desert, is a groundbreaking initiative aimed at revolutionizing the country's aquaculture industry. This ambitious project involves the construction of large scale, high tech fish farms in one of the world's most inhospitable environments. Despite the challenges, China is determined to turn the arid desert landscape into a thriving hub for sustainable fish production. You might be wondering why China would choose to build fish farms in a desert region. There are several reasons behind this bold move. First, the rapid growth of China's population has put immense pressure on the country's food supply, leading to an increased demand for protein-rich foods like fish. Building fish farms in the desert allows China to utilize underdeveloped land and tap into abundant underground water resources, while minimizing the impact on coastal ecosystems and traditional fishing grounds. The Fish Farm Mega Project utilizes cutting-edge technology and innovative design principles to create a sustainable and efficient aquaculture system in the desert. The farms employ Advanced Recirculating Aquaculture Systems RAS, which filter and recycle water to minimize water consumption and waste. Additionally, the facilities harness solar and wind energy to power their operations, further reducing their environmental impact. China's Fish Farm Mega Project in the desert is expected to have a significant economic impact both locally and nationally. The project will create numerous jobs and attract investment in the region, leading to improved infrastructure and the development of supporting industries. On a national level, the increased fish production will help meet the growing demand for seafood, reduce the country's reliance on imports, and bolster China's reputation as a global leader in sustainable aquaculture. The environmental benefits of this ambitious project are also noteworthy. The use of RAS technology and renewable energy sources reduces the farm's carbon footprint and water usage. Moreover, by establishing fish farms in the desert, China is alleviating pressure on overfished oceans and coastal ecosystems, contributing to the global effort to protect marine biodiversity and promote sustainable fishing practices. Despite its potential benefits, China's fish farm mega project in the desert is not without its challenges and criticisms. Some experts have raised concerns about the high energy consumption associated with RAS technology and the long-term sustainability of relying on underground water resources. Additionally, there are concerns about the potential environmental impact of the fragile desert ecosystem, as well as the social implications for local communities. China's fish farm mega project in the desert serves as a fascinating case study for the future of aquaculture. If successful, this project could pave the way for similar initiatives in other arid regions around the world offering a viable solution to the challenges of global food security and sustainable fish production. As the world grapples with the impacts of climate change and population growth, innovative approaches like desert aquaculture could play an increasingly important role in ensuring a sustainable food supply for future generations. In conclusion, China's Fish Farm Mega Project in the Desert is a truly groundbreaking endeavor, showcasing innovative approaches to sustainable aquaculture and food production. By harnessing cutting-edge technology, renewable energy, and unconventional locations, this project has the potential to reshape the global aquaculture industry, meet the rising demand for seafood, and contribute to environmental conservation efforts. What are your thoughts on China's Fish Farm Mega Project in the desert? Do you think this approach could revolutionize the global aquaculture industry? Share your opinions in the comment section below. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications to stay updated with our latest content. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.